Hi guys, how you doing? All right, sorry uh, I haven't been about much lately. Uh, just haven't been out on the boat. The weather's been terrible. Good days when you're at work and uh, bad days when you're at the weekends. It's a bit of a nightmare, but here we are on a nice day. I'm on my own today. Um, James uh, was on his boat when I got there, but I didn't want to wake him, so I'll just come out on my own. He, he can come out if he needs to on his, not a problem. Um, so here we are today. What we're going to do is I'm going to try for a few bass. Um, I caught a couple of bass on a little reef last time. I really enjoyed it. And obviously I really enjoyed the bass as well when I got home. Um, so I'd like to get a couple of bass today for the table. Uh, and obviously if we get any mackerel, um, we will try for some sharks, um, you know, taupe or, um, or even bigger. But um, James last week caught five taupe. So they're still around. Um, and here we are, what, 27th of uh, October? Um, so, you, you know, they're unbelievable, really, that they're still about. But the mackerel all year, really, have been so elusive. So I'll just show you around now. I'm actually out of the mark. I didn't do it from home, so I... I left it to when I was out here. Otherwise, the same old starts of every video, if you know what I mean. So let's put you up here. Right, here we are, and just look at the day out here. And we're around the back of the Isle of Wight. We're just about five miles from Vetnor. So, uh, yeah, beautiful day, absolutely beautiful. I haven't had anything to eat yet. I'm absolutely starving. But I'll get to the mark before I do any, I'll see if I can get any bait fish here. I've got no bait. I've got a little bit of uh, chum that I got left over from last time, so I can take some scraps from that just to get some bait fish, hopefully. Uh, but we'll see how we get on. Um, so there we are. Um, just tidy up here. I've got one mackerel rod in at the moment. rod in at the moment and uh yeah just enjoying it really um let's work this mackerel rod a couple of goes see what goes on it's about 65 foot deep we're not quite in the deeps yet not some catherine's deeps but Last time we was out here, we had some really nice little four inch joey mackerel. And I was hoping to get a few of them if I could, because um, they're just absolute killer bait for bass. I mean, when I get on the bass, I'm gonna have to use lures if uh, I can't get no little joeys. There we are, we're on the bottom there, 65 feet down. I've just come off the bottom. Just give it a few goes. Might be the old pollock down there, or a gurnard, or mackerel. Might be an early whitey, you never know. I can't get nothing on this. I'm gonna bait the feathers up, and just leave them down there for a minute, see what happens. You can't beat bait your feathers really. I 
time I had them was about 20 foot. So that's about a month, month ago. So uh, the chance of them still being there, pretty slim. Pretty slim indeed. But if you don't try, you never know. And that's the best bait you can get, really. set another rod up and then just drift very slowly uh, just set this rod up what I'll do guys I'll set this rod up uh, when I'm all set up and I'm ready to drift I'll bring it back all right and um, I'll speak to you then cheers Nice one. What a bass. Nice bass. Just what I come for. Wow. That's the first bass that I've ever caught on a lure. <laughs> Would you believe it? Properly, you know. Properly. Wow, 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 wow. took me about five, not even five minutes, not even five minutes. There's some big bass down here, big, big bass. Right, let's get it up and show you. There you go, people. What a bass. That's a homer. <laughs> yeah, lovely. Spot on. Pleased with that. First one. So that's going to go in the old uh, tank. Ready for home. So, uh, Thanks, guys. I'll bring it back for we'll get another one. Hi guys, I just wanted to uh, 
uh, tell you about what happened out there. Uh, basically, a really lovely day. Got out there, um, started to lure fish. Couldn't get no bait fish. Started to lure fish. Um, literally, within five minutes, had a nice five-pound bass. I thought, oh, brilliant. Um, got the bass unhooked and put it on in in, in the tray. Um, and then I decided to move back to the bank that I called it off. As I was driving back to the bank, the alarm went off on the engine saying that the water was low. Um, so a bit worrying. So I, uh, I had six bottles of water, drinking water, 500 mils. I put two of them in the radiator, uh, which made the alarm stop. So I decided at that point I'd have to uh, cut it short and head for home, uh, which I'd done. My boat's all sorted now. All up and running, just a small pipe replaced. Thanks for watching, guys. See you on the next one.